everyone, I'm back with another video, and in today's video, we're going to be up against Hero Terminator and Big Elders, and I'm going to be with Zeke Dyer. Now, of course, before we start, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, smash the like button, ring the bell icon to be notified of any content coming out of my channel. Let's begin. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to be the yellow player, and Sig will be the red player. Let's go see how this works out. Again, keep in mind guys, that these enemies are so super in boy. When it comes to Hero Terminator, he basically has like a class 12 therapy. Um, Sig has them class 9 only for all the heroes that he has, except for Wolverine, I think. I'm not exactly sure, but I only have class 7. Wasp, Class 7 Mole, and Class 8 Leviathan. Okay, let's see how this goes. We're just collecting the containers. And uh, Vehicle Factory going level 2, HQ level 2. And we're still collecting the containers here as we speak. Alright, so again, collecting those containers. And from the looks of it, this guy right here has three supply centers, special vehicle factory, and so on. For a Cerberus Hammer, um, Assault Typhoon, um, to gather that super container, and basically me, I'll go with Dragonfly, Armadillo, Wasp, and Rifleman army composition to take that super container for myself. Okay, let's see how this turns out. Hero Terminator has Class 11 Cerberus, by the way. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to contest someone with Class 7, or, yeah, contest him with Class 7 Mole, <laughs> I mean Class 7 Wasp. So here goes the Clash in that super container. Also, um, Zig Zyrus almost, almost got this container right here for himself. Oh, and then that Cerberus. I don't know Big Elders, but man, Big Elders is also a buff guy. So yes, here we go. He's uh, almost got that super container now. And yeah, I mean, that Cerberus just basically ransacked those infantry. Okay. Meanwhile, on my end, that Cerberus is still alive and one typhoon here and I'm able to somewhat yeah oh big elders actually got that super container from Sig okay uh, big elders mind you is rank 25 whereas Sig is rank 27 he has class 9 wasp okay and ooh. oh my goodness man that was so good that was so good man Okay, so we're now on to capturing this super container around here. Fast forward a bit here, and there goes Big Elders with that Cerberus with the passive online or activated. And then of course that annoying Typhoon, which prompted me to retreat regardless of whatever he has, because basically um, ter Hero Terminator can, you know, help him out. Alright, so I'm going to have to retreat here, and uh, yeah, I mean that's going to be my losses and just develop my base, take my losses there. Okay, Scout here. Okay. Serafima. Serafima. Zeus. Zeus going HQ4. Well, basically, Big Elders managed to develop his base actually faster because he got two super containers for himself. What an Imba rank 25 guy. Now, I did hide some infantry right around here, and I was expecting Hero Terminator to attack me, but his Serafima is just there. <laughs> He did not really attack me. LOL. Okay. Alright, Sig has a Hawk going HQ level 4. Mole around here and 3 Porcupines. So yeah, I mean, he is basically prepared against any Seraphim rushes or anything of the sort. Okay, going for that special vehicle factory. Managed to detect that Seraphima. Okay, still hidden infantry around here. To, of course, monitor the activity of Hero Terminator's... Uh, um, Seraphim. Okay, so uh, Big Elders with that good chunk of army going to Vehicle Factory Zeus, to Special Vehicle Factory, and now level 3x facility for that juicy Solaris. Let's see how uh, Sig is doing. Okay, going Prototype Facility level 3, Additional Vehicle Factory, I believe. Yes, it is. And going uh, Special Vehicle Factory level 3 for that chameleon. Okay, so he's moving his uh, Jaguars around. I, for myself, am also doing the same thing. Okay, so uh, Sig right here is just, uh, you know, just 
uh, trimming down those assault infantry to prevent or gain, um, you know, vision. However, again, Big Elders is just gonna go and grab this container with such a huge amount of army with a shield and a typhoon, obviously, because he got those two super containers early on. Meanwhile, Hero Terminator with his own army, three Zoo Serafima, well, yeah, Serafima servers, three typhoons. Not really bad, I have to say, but it is what it is. And, uh, yep, my scout has been destroyed, that dragonfly right there, and... Uh, Oh, wow. Okay, Solaris is already out and are munching down on those Jaguars. Oh, active ability. Almost destroyed that Jaguar and damaging that supply center at the back. And there goes now the uh, engagement right here. Um, Big Elders is positioning in a diagonal formation against what Sig has. First Chameleon popped out uh, right out of Sig. Three molters right off the bat to help with the engagement and defense, exposing that uh, mold to, of course, you know, like bait the, the attacks of those Zeus rockets or whatever into attacking the mold. Leviathan here from Zigzire, and there it goes. Down goes the acid burst, and then obviously the nuclear is to follow. Boom! Eliminating those Zeus as well as severely damaging those Seraphims. Meanwhile, here on my end, I am baiting, or actually just uh, damaging the shield. Okay, escaping with that chameleon, five jaggers inside. Um, there it goes. Down goes my chameleon. Let's see, going back here to Sig. Okay, absolutely nice defense with two chameleons and a jagger. And our focus firing on that shield. Down goes the Seraphim and of course a lot of Typhoons. Going back here on my end. I managed to draw back um, Hero Terminator with at least destroying that annoying shield. And there goes Acid Burst now gonna drop here on my end. Leviathan and then of course the Dragonfly. However, Hero Terminator ordered those Typhoons to attack specifically my Leviathan. And now Hero Terminator's uh, Seraphine which is badly bruised up is here. Sig managed to win the engagement. I'm gonna have to use my Dragonfly to take out that Seraphine. And then the army of Hero Terminator obviously is not looking good right away. With just two Zeus, five Typhoons, and a shield and a Solaris, his uh, Cerberus and the rest of his uh, heroes has been obliterated. Ooh. Okay, that active ability was so clean, dude. All right, and here goes again. We're gonna have to try and contest him again. However, this time around, I'm using a recovery boost to recover the HP of all my units as well as my Leviathan to full health. Okay, let's see. Sig right here doing some damage. Okay. Finding an angle or a good angle to attack those supply centers that are defenseless. And are you going to use the Leviathan as well to attack this position, I believe. However, big elders with that Oh, huge chunk of damage out of that mole, and then of course those uh, jaguars again. The oh my good lord, this is so bad. He is sandwiched between two armies right now, and he's going to have to retreat and take one engagement. Um, Hero Terminator is actually camping right outside in the middle, right outside my base in the middle of the map. Sig is trying to contest both of them alone with two Solaris, one Seraphim, and one Cerberus. Here goes on my end. I'm gonna have to try help Sig out here. Okay, here goes Wasp Acid Burst. Okay, not really that accurate. And here goes in here on my end. Acid Burst. Okay. Oh, good lord. Bam! Okay, absolutely demolishing those Shield Typhoon army combination. However, the Typhoon's range here is insane. Sig Zyre's army is pushing forward here. Wasp will go down. And I'm going to have to retreat here for myself as my chameleons are running out of energy. Okay, here here goes, man. Here goes. Oh, don't push it, Sig. Ah, oh, that Leviathan will go down. And I absolutely believe that Sig was lagging right here due to the no commands here. Oh, shoot, man. One chameleon and two Jaguars out for the count after that Leviathan active skill has been activated. And here goes here on my end. I'm going to have to push once again. And there it goes. I'm gonna have to use everything I have to destroy that shield, weakening the army overall. All right, now this army is without a shield, indeed. Okay, now this army has absolutely been wiped out. 
Okay, two hawks have been annihilated. Sig's army has been demolished. Leviathan will be reproduced once again. And again, I still have this hidden infantry here. And I don't really think that, you know, I mean, it's too quiet right here. There should be like a Seraphima rusher attack or whatever you call it. Additional special vehicle factory for Sig. Malterits right there to scout. Gained or saw the Solaris and Seraphim. Big elders trying to push Sigrid here and took it, taking out one chameleon and one jaguar. All of a sudden, this is so not looking good for Sig right here. And I'm gonna have to try and assist him by activating those chameleons and getting into a formation to not let him be destroyed by big elders right here. Okay, here we go now. However, big hero terminator with three heroes right off the bat, gatekeeping me. Um Oh my good lord, I can't really help out Sig with this, and I really can't abandon my base as well. I need to force my way right here, or else Hero Terminator will attack my defenseless base. Okay, so yeah, Hero Terminator is actually gatekeeping me inside my base to, to prevent me from helping out Sig right here. And it's so not looking good right here. However, those Zoots are battling micro, the shield is not on point. Uh, Seraphim Solaris is still here. Two Typhoons can be seen, and here we go, here we go. Uh, Seraphim's out for the count. I only got like one Chameleon activated. Boom! Oh, dude, as soon as that Cerberus revealed the Chameleon's location, the Solaris took it out effectively. All right there. I actually managed to win this engagement, engagement however, with the exchange of my two Chameleons. Nuclear has been dropped here from Sig's Iron, this severely damaging those units. However, there's just simply too much uh, Big Elder's army right here, and that Seraphine will die, saving that Leviathan from for another day. Okay, so here's what happened here. I am actually forced to either help out Sig or attack Hero Terminator. So I was just wondering if Sig could last longer than. Uh, could last longer or could last the same time as Hero Terminator defending his base. Let's see how this goes. If I help out Sig, this army right here is huge and my army is not huge enough to contest it. So I have the option of attacking Sig or no, attacking Big Elder's army right here to defend Sig or just eliminate Hero Terminator once and for all. Let's see how this plays out. Okay, gold scouting boost to increase the speed to chase after that badly boosted up Solaris. Oh, come on, my man. Come on, my man. Oh, that Solaris still lives to see another day. Okay, so I'm going to have to re uh, regroup my army around here. Meanwhile, we see here Big Elder still trying to eliminate Sig right off the game. And oh, man, the pass of the Leviathan have been taken down. No shield whatsoever around here. Those army are squishy, for they are severely damaged. However, we see, we go back right here. That Solaris from Hero Terminator have been annihilated by my mammoths earlier. Okay, mammoths firing from afar. Okay, now let's see how this goes. All right, Hero Terminator still has like three Zeus, two Typhoons, and two shield generators. Never mind, four shield generators right here. And I'm gonna have to push forward here with my Leviathan Mole to tank the damage out of those Zeus and then use the Mammoth to attack that X facility, preventing any hero production from Hero Terminator. Okay, reinforcement here. Big Elders is just holding out his position for reinforcements to arrive so that the shield, he will have the shield right here and Sig will have to retreat as this is the only army that he got left. He no longer has any construction yard to to uh, build up more base or buildings right there. That Seraphim really did a good number out of my mole right here. And so um, Sig tried to ask me to help him out. However, it's gonna be too late by the time I get there. And that Solaris again is just munching on my class seven mole. <laughs> that's class 12 Solar, a Seraphim by the way. That's class 12 Seraphim, dude. That's no joke, man. Oh, Hero Terminator playing Sandbox right away. <laughs> Okay, so um, Sig actually managed to somewhat, you know, um, avoid by circling, circling around his army. And here goes again with the classic engagement. Nuclear has been dropped on those as it bursted the uh, unit. And then all of a sudden, this is so not looking good for Hero Terminator once again. 
Those Zeus are badly bruised up and are vastly outnumbered by my Jaguar Mammoth Army composition. Bam! Okay, here we go. And I'm gonna have to once again push forward here while using the recovery boost to recover the HP of my badly bruised up Leviathan. And here we go! Lag him, boy! I actually lagged a bit here. And there goes the active skill! Ooh! Disgusting damage! Ooh, my <laughs> lord! Okay, so Sig with the remaining forces of Jaguars, Porcupine, and a mole right here trying to help me out. I'm gonna have to use the mammoths to attack that X facility, eliminating hero production out of Hero Terminator. Okay, here we go. There's no active skill on that Solaris. It's just been activated and uh, disgustingly eliminated my units around away out of the map. Okay, that's so not looking good now for that X facility. Will it go down? Will it go down? Yes, it will. Okay, now, and obviously here. Oh, good lord. It's so not looking good here on my end. Obviously, three heroes who just annihilate all my units around my base. And then, of course, big elders will go straight to my base, annihilating my vehicle factory, preventing me from producing more Jaguars right here. Now we see here, I'm gonna be using or switching over to common defense boost to prolong my base, uh, a base annihilation as long as I can. Okay, now I got like two camellias are active right around here, and uh, some porcupines. There's no vertex here, so I'm not really in need of porcupines as at this moment. Okay, now they're gonna go after my prototype facility. I'm gonna have to build away from my base. Uh, sneak trying to sneak past the base here. Sig trying to help me out. Delay the base destruction by at least baiting big elders into attacking my R, his army, and just like that, that um, small chunk of army left over from Sig has been demolished. And here we go now. Oh shoot! One active skill disgustingly killed all four Jaguars out of the map. Down goes the drain. So technically, I am left with six mammoths, and the rest are, that's it, the rest are porcupines, wasp, mole, leviathan right here. I absolutely have nothing here. Grenadiers as a last ditch effort to somewhat defend myself and the mammoth firing from afar outside the base to bait them out. And again, construction yard, construction yard, six are trying to build, rebuild his base, and yes. Team Imba Heroes, guys. Imba Heroes. Yeah, the MVP of this game are the Typhoons, the Shield, and the Heroes of the Confederation. I mean, there was almost no Zeus Micro here. Just Heroes, Shield, Typhoons, and that's basically it. Okay, so I'm gonna have to use my Class 7 uh, Wasp here to at least destroy that, I don't know, Class 11 Solaris <laughs> with such acute damage and again I'm using a common defense boost to prolong my base's uh, um, durability however with no Jaguars around here it is still not looking good around here yeah man it is so not looking good here in my end I'm trying to use my my chameleon here to cover the uh, turrets however with the uh, with so much army here from Big Elders, it's not really looking good, and I'm gonna have to use my uh, trump card here, the Leviathan. However, there's not really that much for me to destroy, since I only have one hero right here, and uh, yeah, a whole bunch of confed swarming across the map, and my wasp is still not down with that li with that Solaris. Again, I'm just rebuilding my HQ to prolong this battle for as long as I can and eliminate as many things as I can right here. There you go, my mole out for the count. Lug him boy here. Okay, now again, this thing is immortal, dude. Just look at that, dude. <laughs> okay, meanwhile, my Leviathan right here is raining rampage on Big Elder Space. However, with the arrival of those typhoons, it is really not looking good as my Leviathan is vastly outnumbered. Okay, Sig already left the game for it is already le irrelevant for us to continue. However, I am still wanted to go and destroy that Solaris. 
and destroy as many things as I can with the Leviathan that I have left. So yes, man. Can I destroy it? Can I destroy it? Oh, and then there's another Solaris. Right. Finally taking out that Solaris from Hero Terminator. And now I got like <laughs> big elder Solaris and still they're chasing after my my Leviathan and uh, yeah my goodness man it is not really looking good right here right now and that's gonna be it I'm gonna have to try and prolong this uh, agonizing uh, base hunting here for as long as I can however it's gonna be G use the active ability on that. okay so yeah Will I be able to destroy that? Yes! I managed to destroy two Solaris with my Imboy Wasp, with the help of my Mammoth, who's just been annihilated. And this is all that I have left. Leviathan and Wasp. And that's gonna be all for today's video. This was a losing battle, however, I really think that the way this played out was so epic. And yeah, there was an HQ being built here by Hero Terminator. Yeah, G, G. All right, well, if you guys enjoyed the video, again, smash the like button, ring the bell icon to be notified of any content, and of course, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a great day and good luck with your battles. Bye. The battle is lost.